This is the Men of High Value channel. My name is Joseph Darling. Today, I want to dig deeper into semen retention and what it has to do with your emotional stability. Understand the definitions that I've got for masculinity and femininity, and that is femininity is emotional instability, being all over the place and not consistent. And masculinity is being consistent, being emotionally stable, and being capable of doing that which you need to do whether you feel like it or not. One of the biggest things that are stopping men from becoming successful is simply this, not being consistent. And that inconsistency comes from them being emotionally unstable, or in other words, driven by their emotions. When they see something fancy, they want it. When they see in a beautiful woman, they want her and they focus on that instead of the task at hand that they needed to complete. In order to become successful, you've got to focus, follow one course until successful. But when there are shiny objects and women around, I don't want to focus. I want to do that which my emotions are craving. Feminine. Okay, you need to get over it and the best way to get over it is practicing semen retention. Think about it this way. When you were a boy between the ages of zero to nine years old, you had the exact same levels of testosterone as girls do. Same levels, completely the same. And then at nine years old, guess what happens? You begin to develop testosterone at a fast pace, exponentially in fact you end up having 10 to 12 times more testosterone than the average woman, if you're normal. But most guys these days are beginning to lose their testosterone fast. And what I found is that it has a lot to do with porn usage and ejaculation. You see, when you begin your sperm production at 9, 10, 11, whenever it is that you started, you began to get interested in girls. And obviously the easiest way to have sexual experiences and to basically see naked girls and to see them have pleasurable sex, which is fake, is porn. That's basically what guys are connecting themselves to and it's an epidemic and it's gonna grow out of proportion in the coming future if it hasn't already. You see the downfall of society has become sex has become cheap and it has become easy. Not only on the internet, but now that guys are beginning to learn what players do and they're studying it and they're now beginning to apply these things out in the marketplace and literally destroying women's lives even though women want it. The fact is, guys don't understand how much destruction happens when you sleep around with girls. Girls end up not being able to pair bond at all after they've had a lot of sexual partners. And the likelihood of divorce increases dramatically. What is also interesting, this is a detour, but what is also interesting is that guys who end up sleeping around with women and want things to work out because they're feminine, the girls basically leaves and the guy basically thinks about the memory of this wonderful girl that he got broken up with. Bro, this is all because you were chasing girls and you weren't supposed to be chasing them in the first place. The reason why is because at that age when you begin that sperm production, that is the time when you're not supposed to start a family. That's not when you're supposed to have sex. This is the time when you're supposed to develop discipline and emotional stability and do the opposite of what girls want you to do. During this time frame, you're supposed to work on yourself. You're supposed to work on your skills. You're supposed to work on your knowledge, understanding, reading, mentorship, being led, understanding what success in the long run looks like so you can apply it to your life. Both men and women truly, deep down, desire long-term, committed, loyal relationships with depth. And that depth is not possible when people sleep around. But since sex has become so accessible now because of porn and because of women simply throwing themselves at you as soon as they get some alcohol in their veins, it has become too easy. There is no 
reward at the end of the rainbow anymore. It's right here. Have some reward. Have, enjoy yourself. Except for the fact that our brain doesn't work like that. The moment we get high stimulating rewards coming to our brain, our hormones begin to go out of whack. Our dopamine receptors stop functioning properly. And once you take it to the extreme, you begin to have erectile dysfunction. And you begin to lose the masculinity that you received as a gift from the universe. It's a gift. The moment you ejaculate, the moment you, you start that addiction of porn and ejaculation, porn and ejaculation, you become a girl. You remain in your femininity. Which one of you who are watching this video want to remain in your femininity? Raise your hand. Not one, okay? It doesn't work like that because we know inherently, but also simply because it's everywhere, women don't like feminine guys. End of story. Feminine girls are attracted to masculine guys. Guys that have power, guys that have the ability to do, to perform, to protect and provide and to create that which women desire. And what's at the foundation of women's emotional needs is safety and security. That there are resources available and that the man that they find is able to provide them with that. The more feminine you are, the more emotionally unstable you're going to be, the more inconsistent you're going to be and the less success you're going to have in your life. Do you want feminine women in your life? Yes. Do you want one or do you want multiple? Because we teach on this channel that you're supposed to have three. And I'm completely against sleeping around and I'm completely against having sex outside of family relationships. But what I am for is responsible polygamy. And that is possible. Responsible polygamy basically having Three women, not two, not four, none of the above, but three women who love each other and who are intimate with each other and who want to love the same guy. You can be that guy. If you learn how to channel your sexual energy by retaining your sperm and you begin to retain your sperm over the long term, things are going to start looking up for you. Things are going to become consistent and you're going to be emotionally stable. You're going to develop confidence. You're going to develop power. You're going to develop the ability to do and to take action and to become wealthy. And once you become wealthy, you will have prepared the foundation of safety and security for the women of your choice. And then these women will love you forever. They will have kids with you and you will be able to set up your amazing empire for all of you to enjoy. But it all starts with this. PMO. Avoiding porn, masturbation and orgasm. And it begins as early as possible. The moment you begin to have the ability to ejaculate, that is the exact time when you should stop ejaculating. This is the time when you should retain it. And people say that it's not possible, it's not possible. Uh, yes, it is possible. That's like saying it's not possible to become a millionaire. Yes, it is. Other people have done it a lot. And the same thing for guys like me. It is possible to retain. Over the years between 18 and 23, and those are the years when guys are, you know, would say that it's impossible for them to retain. Bro, trust me, during that time frame, I probably ejaculated less than five times and half of them were probably wet dreams. Okay, so I know that you can too. It's possible. It's not hard actually once you get past 90 days. And the worst part is the first 30 to 40 days with your emotions are all over the place. And, and that is the time when you can basically measure your femininity. Try it the first 30 to 40 days. <laughs> you'll see you'll be all over the place I just got a text message from someone now saying that bro I get super anxious and I've been depressed and low and do you have any tips blah 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 and I'm like bro just get past the first 30 to 40 days man and then you'll see how you can observe your emotions you'll be able to be more emotionally stable and he's going to get consistency from that
And that consistency is what produces exponential growth. Learn and understand about the compounding effect of energy, of money, of relationships. Transactions done consistently over a long period of time produces exponential growth or exponential depth. That's what you want. You want to come to the point where everything just naturally gravitates towards you all of the time where life is beautiful, life is amazing, and it simply happens to you. And every time you touch something, poof, it becomes gold. You will have the Midas touch simply from practicing this one thing, semen retention. This is the key, my friend. Start with that one small step at a time, get to 30 days and report to me on this channel in these comment sections and learn everything that you can about three girls in love. Okay. It's critical that you do that because that creates motivation. Understand all the things that I'm doing on my channel, man. It's not just semen retention. We've got the whole package here, a philosophy for success and for happiness that will take you to endless joy, man. Seriously, I'm so grateful for the things that I know. I'm so grateful I can share this with you guys on YouTube, man. 20 years ago, we didn't have this. I couldn't share any of this while well, I didn't know it back then, but now I can actually share it with the world on my own TV channel. It's flipping insane. Seriously, I was just thinking about it. I was just filled with gratitude for understanding the things that I understand and that I'm able to help other guys to succeed because of the belief and the confidence and the things that I know about senior retention, about relationships, about leadership, about business that I've learned over my short period of time here on earth. I'm fired up for you. I'm excited to see your potential and your exponential growth. Make sure you contact me and also sign up on Instagram account at three girls in love. That's three with the digit three, three girls in love on Instagram, participate there so that we can build up the movement of men of high value. Get to those 30 days, my friend, and I'll see you in the next video.